Hello, I am Joseph Quia. I am doing a live stream Memorial Weekend concert. Uh, this is about the same time of year that our city has a Mushroom Mardi Gras event, but this year they don't have it because of the COVID-19, uh, the coronavirus. But I'm doing a live stream concert just like all other celebrities do. Anyway, um, I'm gonna sing songs from my 10 track uh, acapella pop studio album, Ultimate Celebrity Blackout. <clears throat> I'm gonna sing them as they go in the album. So the same order, <clears throat> one through 10. And uh, this first time I'm doing a full live stream. I did a single track live stream. I sure love being a slutty with a mask and without a mask. So I sang that song twice uh, about uh, a week or two ago, but it was just like a single song, not multiple tracks. So this time I'm gonna do the whole album. I'm gonna start with the song called Don't Black Me Out, which is basically a song against media blackouts. And uh, that um, song uh, goes like this. I wear black just to prevent media blackouts Because I want them to know I was famous ten years before now They are welcome to migrate me ten million times a day If they don't black me out Yeah, you're welcome to migrate me ten million times a day Just don't black me out I wear black just to bring back free speech and free press. I guess when it comes to public speaking, I am the best. They are welcome to migrate me 10 million times a day if they don't black me out. Yeah, you're welcome to migrate me 10 million times a day. Just don't black me out. I wear black because pretty girls wear it on Black Friday. If there is anything special about Friday, Friday is my day. They are welcome to my great meets a million times a day if they don't black me out. Yeah, you're welcome to my great meet a million times a day. Just don't black me out. That was my uh, first track uh, from the Ultimate Slutty Blackout studio album. That one's called Don't Black Me Out. Uh, I hope you can see my live stream correctly. Uh, Anyway, uh, so I'm going to sing my next song now, and uh, my next song is called It's Okay to Walk Barefoot on Stage. It's, uh, it goes uh, like this. It's okay to walk barefoot on stage. It proves that you're really brave. Theater owners, they watch you like a hawk aren't even worth their stock. It's okay to walk barefoot on stage. It proves that you're really brave. Stadium owners, they watch you like a hawk, aren't even worth their socks. It's okay to walk barefoot on stage. It proves that you're really brave. Opera owners, they watch you like a hawk, aren't even worth what they've got. Okay, so now my next song is called Flood Me With Media. Water and media have one thing in common. It's always better to have too much than not enough. 
flood me with media, drown me in publicity. Don't even try to censor me or I'll drown your lifeguards, you'll see. There's no need to rescue me from floods of free publicity. So if you try to censor me, I'll drown your lifeguards, you'll see. Water and media have one thing in common. It's always better to have too much than not enough. So flood me with all your media. Drown me in free publicity. Don't even try to censor me from floods of publicity. It's way past time to send me down that long mainstream of publicity. So if you try to censor me, I'll drown your lifeguards, you'll see. Water and media have one thing in common. It's always better to have too much than not enough. So flood me with all your media. Drown me in deep publicity. Don't even try to censor me from floods of publicity. It's way past time to send me down that long mainstream of publicity. The Hollywood Dam is about to fail so you could no longer censor me. A song about how much I love the media. <laughs> Next song uh, I'm gonna be singing. These are all originals. There's ten tracks, ten originals. Uh, so the next song, oh, is a really good one. It's actually called Black Beach Cruiser, and it's about a celebrity that rides a Black Beach Cruiser. <laughs> I've seen a lot more of those around town lately. I'm sure they're becoming more common worldwide too. Uh, but anyway, uh, I have a bling back Black Beach Cruiser. It's this Electra brand Black Beach Cruiser. It has chrome handlebars. It's black. It has my name on it, Joseph Quiro. It also says Ava Slowdy. It has chrome mirrors. Really, I really like those Black Beach Cruisers, but I'll start singing this song now. I saw a celebrity on a Black Beach Cruiser. The bike was so bling that the cars were the losers. He can swim around the wharf or make your car look like a dwarf. I saw a celeb on a Black Beach cruiser. The bike was so bling that the cars were the losers. He can swim around the wharf or make your car look like a dwarf. I saw an A-lister on a Black Beach cruiser. The bike was so bling that the cars are the losers, he can swim around the wharf or make your car look like a dwarf. I saw Joseph Carrillo on a Black Beach cruiser, the bike was so bling that the cars are the losers, he can swim around the wharf or make your car look like a dwarf. That was one of my shorter songs, um, Black Beach Cruiser, but it's also on YouTube. You can see the studio version on YouTube as well as Pandora, Spotify, everything else has the original version of that, and uh, that's the studio recorded version. Well, this one I'm just singing live. It's the uh, first time doing a, a full live stream of my album, but anyway, uh, my uh, next song, Oh, the next one is uh, a really, a really good song called "I Sure." Or you don't need school to be a celebrity. So that's it's uh, it's right to Black Beach Cruiser. Wow, yeah, it's one of my favorites. There's ten tracks this album I made, and uh, I have some really good songs. Some are good, some are okay. I just uh, they're all a cappella pop. That's what's unique about them. So it's it's unique. 
genre, uh, it's everything's a cappella, because there's no background music, but then pop genre. So I, I'm getting used to live streaming, but the live performances are a lot easier than this kind of live stream. But it's uh, just just because of coronavirus, all these celebrities are doing live streams, thought I'd try. But anyway, I'm going to sing uh, You Don't Need School to Be a Celebrity, because that's the next song. Talent is something you are born with. You cannot learn it from school. Sometimes it is a good thing to break stupid government's rules. You don't need school to be a celebrity because school's not needed in the entertainment industry. I know there are entry barriers, but I swim through them like an aircraft carrier. I know I sound vain and hollow, but some rules are not meant to be followed. You don't need school to be a celebrity, because school's not needed in the entertainment industry. I won't give up being a celebrity just because of my past in school. I'll just have to be like Rosa Parks and break those stupid rules. You don't need school to be a celebrity because school's not needed in the entertainment industry. Okay, so that was like the, the fifth song of my album. I'm going to see what my next one is. Uh, let's see. Uh, <clears throat> oh, all celebrities are self-employed. That is, that song's about being a slurry. No one promotes for you. You have to self-promote. You have to do everything yourself. It's, it's a, interesting being a celebrity. You have to write the songs yourself, you have to organize the performances yourself, you have to do everything yourself, even the promoting and the, the, uh, the way you do the press releases. Everything's done yourself. It's the way celebrities do stuff. They always self-promote. So anyway, uh, here it goes. It's also, it's also, it's also um, says how you need the news and that uh, Kind of reminds me of Michael Moore of Morganal Times, part of Metro Newspapers, or Metro Silicon Rally Newspapers. Well, anyway, Morganal Times has this reporter, Michael Moore, that I'm trying to get him to do a story on my album. He's never done it, and the album was released a couple years ago. But anyway, I'm going to sing the All Celebrities are Self Employed. Uh, All celebrities are self employed. Performing on a big stage brings us joy. We don't need no stupid W-2s. We just need the news. All celebrities are self-employed. Performing on a big stage brings us joy. We don't need no stupid bunny foo-foos. We just need the news. All celebrities are self-employed. Performing on a big stage brings us joy. Even if you think I am a goon, I still need the news. Justin Bieber and me are self-employed. Performing in a stadium brings us joy. Even if you think we are a goon, we still need the news. All celebrities are self-employed. Performing on a big stage brings us joy. We don't need no stupid W-2s. We just need the 
news. And that song also is self employed. As you see, it says, We don't need no stupid W 2s, we just need the news. You see, it also talks about the little bunny foo foo in it. That's why it has, uh, We don't need no stupid bunny foo foos, we just need the news. See? And so it's so it has it's a really cool lyrics. It's like uh, promoting how you need news to be a celebrity. It's like uh, part of the queer. It, it really exposes the music industry and things get really strange. There's not enough news, lack of third party sources, all kind of strange things st start happening. And uh, but anyway, I hope you like the all celebrities are self employed song. I'm gonna get ready to sing my next song from the album. Oh yeah, the next song is actually a seventh song. It's actually my favorite song. I sure love being a slouty. <laughs> I looked up stage, down stage, stage left, stage right, but nowhere on me could I find stage right. I love the media and the paparazzi. Boy, I sure love being a celebrity. Even the biggest audience in sight could not give me any stage right. I love the tabloids and the paparazzi. Boy, I sure love being a celebrity. I walked the catwalk to the ultimate high, but I still could not find any stage right. I love the limelight and the paparazzi. Boy, I sure love being a celebrity. Even Phantom Power and the theater ghost light could not give me any stage right. I love my fans and the paparazzi. Boy, I sure love being a celebrity. That was a good one. So now I'm going to try to uh, get ready for my next song. Uh, I think the next one is a pretty cool one. I think it... Okay, yeah. So... The next one... Oh, it's called For the Record. Oh, okay, so that's, that's a really good one. And... Uh, And I'm gonna start singing that one now. I'm singing for the record, cause I'm making an LP. I'm singing for the record, because I love performing. Nothing's off the record when you're interviewing me, because I love performing and I love publicity. I'm making an album so they can't stop me from being a celebrity. I'm singing for the record because I'm making an LP. I'm singing for the record because I love performing. Nothing's off the record when you're interviewing me because I love performing and I love publicity. I'm making an album so they can stop me from being a celebrity. I'm singing for the record because the record's what I need. I'm singing 
for the record because I love performing. Nothing's off the record when you're interviewing me because I love performing and I love publicity. I'm singing for the record so everyone can see that I always was a real celebrity. Whew, that was one of my good ones. Uh, so I have a couple left. Uh, so the ninth one, I think it's about green screens, but let's see. Uh, Yeah, it is. Uh, a screen flashed bright green. It's not only about green screens, it's about things like uh, COINTELPRO, Hollywood Blacklist, the way celebrities get hacked. It's, it's like when you're making yourself a celebrity, stop acclaiming yourself a celebrity, there's all kinds of things they do. And some of the lyrics are in this song. Um, you know, green screen's a thing you do with um, when you make videos, music videos, movies. It's used for all kinds of stuff, but the screen flashback green references that, it references the man in black. It's uh, about this stuff uh, that they do. So it's a really interesting song to me. I don't know if you like it, but uh, it goes like this. I remember the day I dove into Hollywood. That day I made a discovery, hidden very good. The screen went bright green and the images were real obscene. The men in black have aliens that hack celebrities. It looked like something straight out of a sci-fi movie scene. But the men in black have aliens that hack celebrities. Can you just let me be a celebrity? And tell the men in black to stop hacking me. Ooh, kind of forgot some of that one. Let's see. Let's see. Not used to live streaming. More used to like live performances. Let's see. Ooh, better. Let's see. Okay. Okay, I gotta try singing that one again because I forgot something. Okay. I remember the day I dove into Hollywood. That day I made a discovery, hidden very good. The screen fresh bright green and the images are real I've seen. The men in black have aliens and hack celebrities. It looked like something straight out of a sci-fi movie scene. But the men in black have aliens that hack celebrities. The screen flashed bright green, the images are real I've seen. If I could afford to write a book, I would tell you everything. I saved four grand on a music video using my green screen. But as a consequence, the aliens hacked me. My singing is much better than that girl's song about Friday. But the aliens hacked me almost every day. The screen flashed bright green and the images are real I've seen. The men in black have aliens that hack celebrities. Can you just let me be a celebrity and tell the men in black to stop hacking me? Do you have any questions about the song, just look at them on YouTube or Spotify or Pandora. Those are the recorded versions. I'm singing this live, but I'm singing the whole album live stream. Uh, let's see. One more song. Uh, this album is very hard to promote, so I get tired just promoting it, but, oh, Okay, the next one is called Power of Publicity. That's actually the last song. Uh, that was the hardest one I remember, but Scream Lash, I, I kind of forgot some lyrics too, so that's, uh, 
I just want to try, uh, I don't need money, I just need fame. Let me be a celebrity, this is not a game. A celebrity is the true me, that's the power of publicity. That's the power of publicity. I'm making an album fast to be a celebrity before the tea party makes the men's shoes for me. A real celebrity is the true me. That's the power of publicity. I'm making an album fast, faster than a train. It's no harder than speeding in the pouring rain. A real celebrity is the true me. That's the power of publicity. That's the power of publicity. Uh, yeah, and out of all my channels, you know, Spotify, Pandora, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, my website, JoelStreetGrill.com. Uh, what needs views the most is my YouTube channel. It needs a lot of uh, viewing, uh, watch hours, people watching it. That's YouTube.com slash JoelStreetGrill.com. My main website uh, is JoelStreetGrill.com. Uh, Facebook, it's Facebook.com slash Official. Um, so there's, there's a lot of different channels. I have links to all the social media on my website, also on Google and Bing, you'll find side panels that links to my content as well. I also have a YouTube topic, just to create a topic, but that's different than just a slow to YouTube. So I have two YouTube channels. I should follow both. Uh, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, everything, and uh, or also Pinterest. Uh, I have uh, a lot of different platforms. So you can watch my videos on Pandora, Spotify, uh, iHeartRadio. Um, it's also listed on all music. Uh, all of like Blackout's the name of the album, and all the tracks are listed, uh, including the ones that I sang. And uh, I hope you follow me on all those channels. And uh, I hope you can invite me to your next event, because th I'm not used to doing live streams like this. I'm more used to doing actual performances on stage. I'm not used to doing live streams through the internet like this. This is the first time doing a live stream actually in front of these curtains. So I just thought I would try out live streaming since all the other celebrities are trying it. And, and they're the same way, they're used to the actual events, not the live streaming like this. Uh, but it seems to work pretty good for the first time doing it. And I hope you'll follow me on my website, justregret.com or uh, my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash justregret. Uh, Thank you uh, for watching this live stream. Uh, I know it's my first time doing it. I hope it came out okay, but just uh, thank you for watching.